didn't joke about taking a gun and shooting people. A Nashville woman lands in jail charged with attempted terrorism. A local company's HR issue quickly became a police matter when a temporary employee allegedly made threats against non-Muslims. Now, police say a conversation about religion ended with a Somali immigrant saying non-believers should die. Tiani Jones has more. In the offices of SIVA, a contractor for Dell, the etiquette rule of not discussing religion and politics was broken last weekend. Police tell News 2 that 29-year-old Amal Abdullahi made statements to a co-worker that scared him so much, police had to get involved. There have been too many events in the United States and around the world, tragic events that began with uttered words. In a police affidavit obtained by News 2, Abdullahi allegedly told a co-worker that she was ready to die for Allah. She also said that this whole country will be Muslim soon. But what alarmed the other employee is when she said all these coffers are unbelievers should die. And her life starts after death. Her life is not here. And ultimately she said, allegedly, that she should pick up a gun and shoot people there. A source tells News 2 that when police went to question the woman, they discovered the address listed on her driver's license was a vacant lot. Police eventually caught up with her, and she denied having a conversation with the accuser. But then during further questioning, ultimately admitted to having a conversation of a religious nature. She's being charged with attempted terrorism. In a statement to News 2, Siva said Abdullah High was a temp worker and that Siva takes employee safety very seriously. We investigate all safety-related incidents and, when necessary, contact law enforcement. It's very important to emphasize that this investigation and prosecution involves one individual and is in no way reflective of Nashville's Muslim community. Tiani Jones, Nashville's News 2. Abdullah High is being held on a $50,000 bond.